Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov, and this is How to Solve a Geometry Truth Table. Now, geometry truth tables can be very complicated or very simple, but no matter what, the same rules apply in finding the solution. You have to find every possible outcome of the truth table. So let's take a look at one. Let's say we have P, Q, and R. So we'll build a table out of that, and again, we're going to be mindful of every possible outcome. So we also need to think about true and false. Now, the best way to do that is start with truth for P. We're only thinking about truth for P. So if we have P is true, Q is true, R is true. That's the most ideal truth combination. Then we could say P is true, Q is true, R is false. So we're keeping it as many truths as possible. Now we want to say P is true, Q is false, R is true. And we could say P is true, Q is false, R is false. So this is all the combinations for P being true. And then we'd say P is false. Q is true, and R is true. P is false, Q is false, and R is true. P is false, Q is false, and R is false. And we could have the combination of P is false, Q is true, and R is false. So now we have all the four possibilities for P being true. True, 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 false, true, false, true, true, false, false. And then all the combinations for P being false. False, true, true, false, false, true, false, 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 true, false. So that is how you create a geometry truth table. Mm -hmm.